How's the patient? Seeing as they're still breathing after being caught in a massive explosion, I'd say pretty good. Coming through! What happened? Shanking. Put him over there. Sorry about that. Have they said anything yet? Not yet. But I'm about to take the bandages off. Fall jobbies in space. Welcome to another review, and it is Central the motherfucking two. Now, this is just basically the same as the first game. It's the same map, slightly changed about a wee bit. Looks a wee bit better, plays a wee bit better. Some extra cars, all that pish. Some new world activities out in the open world, but essentially it is the same game. Just so we're uh, all aware of that going forward no big changes, it feels more like DLC, I think that's why it didn't resonate with me the same, it's because I kind of had already played this, but not really, but kind of, the, the gangs are slightly different, but they're all still colour coordinated, like a Tim Burton movie, notably Edward Scissor's hands, yeah I did say that wrong on purpose, so aye, it's, um, it's the same game essentially, and it's not the only game that's done this, I will cover other ones that have done a very, a very a similar a thing. Okay, right, anyway, so opening in the game, uh, you can go woman this time, yay, well done. Then you, uh, at the end of the first game you get blown up in an explosion, but I was a guy, and I couldn't go a woman, I would have if I could have, but I couldn't, and so I've been blown into a woman, the explosion was so strong that it changed my uh, sex, so I'm now a woman, smashing. And the first thing you'll do uh, upon breaking free of your bonds is kill a doctor. <laughs> Excellent. Oh! Buenas noches, oh, cabrones. Let's see someone tap that. Did she say carone? Carone! Didn't realise we were playing RE4. Sorry, Resident Evil 4. <laughs> we inside our joke there a lot and saying just because they're all speaking fucking Spanish and I don't know what the fuck that means, but what buenas noches. Probably goodbye, dick face or some, some like that. Anyway, so you escape the prison and then it's a fucking mad dash and a boat and you get to shoot lots of other boats and helicopters. Now, when I played this on backwards compatible on the Xbox Series X, the frame rate fucking tanked. I mean, it became slideshow material and it was something to do with the water effects. I don't know, the machine just didn't like the water in the game. It's not so bad in the, the Series X right enough. But there are still wee dips in the intro, and that's really all this sort of major uh, frame rateage problemos that I have seen thus far. So that's fucking good, isn't it? So then you get to show and you're still in your fucking overalls, like you're a painter decorator, and so you have to run about and get a show. It's just kind of the same start of every Saints Row game. It's like, go get clothes, go buy a gun, go get a car, not in that order. You understand? So, fuck it, that's what we did, that's what we're doing. Yabba fucking dabba dobba do. I have to say, the rain effects in this game are much better than the other one, and the lightning effects are even better than that. Does it look like a glitch every time the fucking screen flashes, and I have a sort of mini stroke in the back of my brain hemorrhage? Now, there's a few new activities in the open world that give you respect. My favourite being crowd control. Crowd control is hilarious. This is where you've got to save people from fucking uh, getting uh, attacked by a, like, say, save celebrities from getting attacked by fucking super fans and they'll run up and bat you at the back of the head with a fucking baseball bat. And just some of the shit you get to do to these people is hilarious. Have a wee look, eh? Go and take a look. Take a fucking look! <laughs> <laughs> and that's just the greatest thing when you can whap people into helicopter blades or scalp their faces off a of fucking metal post. It's just, it's just violence. I just, I, I love the violence. I love the violence, the blood and the guts. Um, story. Don't know. Takeover, Steelport, Stillwater, Jobby Water, Jobby Water. That'd be. Scottish version, wouldn't it? Welcome to Jobby Water, a town built on shite. That really is the greatest of the new sort of open world respect gaining activities. There's racing, there's chop shop, there's all the, the insurance fraud, all the usual keek. I found 
uh, I found tags again. Uh, they've changed. You no longer push a wee button to like a wee combination of buttons to tag it. You have to actually spray it. So you'll use the left stick to move up and down, and use the right trigger to spray, and it'll it'll run out of steam. And you have to shake it, and you have to wiggle the right fucking stick to 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 shake the bastard and thing. And it's, it's a bit of a pain in the ass. I think I prefer the old way. To be honest with you, it was just bing bang boom done. Now it's like. And this time the fucking that time all your your wee cronies are come to kick your cunt in and it's like just gonna get the fuck. Found CDs again as well. So that that is really it. I mean, there's no great shakes. So there is a zombie mode, but I can't remember how to access it. So you're just gonna have to find that for yourself. So it's I mean it's a nice companion piece to the first game, but. I don't know. I'd be, I'd maybe play one or the other. I wouldn't bother. But in fact, I wouldn't bother with the first one unless you're really, really, really intrigued. And you want to get those sweet chivos or something like that. Uh, I'd just play this one because, like I said, it's the same fucking game, same map, same everything. A few new different activities. There is an activity where you get to spray shite over things as well, but I didn't, I didn't play any of them this time. I was just literally just gathering footage for this fucking. Poo poo review you, so that's it. I'm done. Steam is run out. The next one you'll get is Saints Row 4. Cheery bye now, little lambs to the slaughter. <laughs> Damn it! Oh!